So I am back with another Cyberpunk Iconic Weapon Guide and this one is for another one off that if you missed when the opportunity came up, it's gone for good. Today we have a quick guide on how you can grab this iconic weapon called the Widow Maker. How's it going guys, my name's DPJ and if you enjoyed this video leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more Cyberpunk, be sure to subscribe. So later on within the story mission, the main story mission, you will meet a lady called Panam and start doing missions with her. You will eventually get to a mission called Ghost Town, which is the ninth mission along the main quest line after the prologue. Now during this mission, and I will try my best not to spoil it for you, you will have to go and retrieve Panem's keys to her car. Once you get this part of the mission done, she then talks about getting revenge on Nash with you which you want to agree to do with her. Once you agree, you will head to a cave-like system where you eventually get to Nash and his clan. There will be a little pain in the ass to take out, so just be a little cautious here. So once you've taken them all out, Nash is also here somewhere. For me, he was a little buggy, but I eventually killed him. Upon looting bodies, make sure you locate and loot Nash. As I won't lie guys, I picked up this weapon and didn't even know where it came from as it wasn't until running around last night that I realised I had this beast. So I went back over hours of footage and I realised it was Nash I looted for this weapon, the Widowmaker, so it's easily missable. So this tech precision rifle, this rare iconic. And remember guys, iconic weapons can be upgraded, so if you find one you like and want to upgrade it to continue using it and making it even more powerful, it's as simple as finding materials to use to upgrade weapons. So looking at this weapons item card, you can understand why I needed to let you guys know about it. With its 278 damage per second stat, with a 12.41 attack per second, it's quite a beast. It's a tech weapon so it can be charged to release a powerful shot. It deals plus 16 to 20 chemical damage, it's got a 2 charge time and a 0.2 charge multiplier. Plus 33% poison chance with a real high 1.5 headshot multiplier. Description is Nash's rifle, looks like he won't be needing it anymore, fires 2 projectiles per shot and deals chemical damage with an increased chance to apply poison, charged shots deal more damage. So yes guys, definitely grab this weapon if it isn't too late for you. This is a must have and will certainly help you along the way. So the Widowmaker is a weapon exclusive to killing Nash when working with Panam within the ghost town mission which is a part of the main story quest, the ninth mission along after the prologue. If all dialogue options are correct with Panam you will get a chance to go and kill Nash and take out his allies. Upon doing this loot Nash's body and you will be rewarded this incredible Widowmaker precision rifle. And on that note guys the end of the video has arrived, just another short but sweet one, a quick guide and if that's what you like with cyberpunk quick guides make sure you check out my channel and subscribe if you like what you see. But guys if you enjoyed this video leaving a like really helps out, join my discord for way more cyberpunk chat and hopefully I will see you on that next one.